The Washington State Transportation Commission, which sets toll rates, is finalizing a plan to increase what drivers pay to use two major roads. First, the Highway 99 tunnel in downtown Seattle, where there are a pair of tolling proposals, both of which would take effect in October. One option is a 15% toll increase for all rates at all times of the day. That would cost drivers between 15 and 35 cents more than what they currently pay. The second scenario is a 25 cent toll increase for all rates at all times of the day. There was a huge drop in traffic during the pandemic, and the commission is looking for ways to make up that lost revenue. Drivers who use the Tacoma Narrows Bridge will also likely pay more come October. The commission is considering a 25 cent toll rate increase for all drivers, whether they pay with a good to go pass at the toll booth or through the mail. Take the ferry? Sorry, it too could get a little more costly. The commission is finalizing a plan to increase fares by 2.5% in October, then another 2.5% next year. And there's still time for drivers to weigh in on the toll proposals. The commission is taking public comments for about another week, and then they plan to finalize and adopt the toll rates in August. Greg? I noticed you didn't mention the 520 bridge. I know they had been discussing toll increases there as well. I thought they were anyway. Yeah, we've learned there will not be a toll increase on the 520 bridge this year. They're pushing that back a few years to 2023. There are a few scenarios there under considerations, uh, but drivers can expect to pay between 20 cents and $1.10 more depending on the time of day.